Hello friends, welcome to CSAP Space. Today in this video session, we will discuss how to export Gradeway into PDF form in ASP.NET. So let's start. We open a Visual Studio and create here a new website. Click on a websites and here we select ASP.NET empty website and then here we choose a write a name it's a grid view grid view pdf pdf export then click to ok now it's creating my project now project is created so we go to our solution explorer and uh, here we add a new web form we select a web form and then click to add button so first of all we drag and drop a grid view to this design view firstly we connect a database with my project i already created a database for this project is a name as a test so we bind this imply table and display all the records in the grid view so first of all we drag and drop a grid view it's a grid view and then we bind the database from the brand grid view from the database table here we select a database source then click to ok now here we select a database connection strings we see this is like a database connection string and then click next now database is connected here we choose imply table and then click to next and if we test the query it find all the records and then click to finish now the table is connected and uh, we take one more buttons for exporting the data we go to property and here we write export pdf then click to their click event and uh, then here we write a code for exporting excel response dot content type is equal to equal to application application slash pdf first of all we need to add uh, some some dll files for exporting grid view into pdf form so we go to our solution explorer and head here uh, reference we browse our dll files into this project so we browse it click on a browse buttons and it's a browse of files dll files in my desktop Now we browse this itex sort for DLA. Then click to add buttons. And now we need to add some more namespaces using itext itext sort dot text and using itext sort dot text dot pdf and using my text sorp dot text dot html dot simple parser now we add a code here it's a response dot add header 
इट्स कंटेंट डिस्पोजिशन डिस्पोजिशन एंड इट्स अटैचमेंट and it's a file name is equal to here we write a file name like demo test dot pdf and response dot catch dot set catchability is http catchability dot no catch and it's a string writer string writer here we need to add a name space for this it's a system dot io and it's a sw is equal to new string writer it's a html text writer hw is equal to new html text writer and here we pass a string writer object and then pass a grid view one dot render control and then here we pass a html writer object let's say string reader sr is equal to new string reader and here we pass a sw dot string string writers as a string and then document we define here a document pdf doc is equal to new new document and it is here a page size page size dot uh, page size dot a4 size here we select a4 size and it's a uh, fonts 10 app and it's a 10 app app it's for zero f for top Now it's a HTML worker. HTML parse is equal to new HTML worker. Then here we pass a PDF doc and it's a PDF writer dot get instance it's a pdf doc dot comma response response dot out stream and it's a pdf doc dot open and it's a html parser dot parse and here we pass a uh, object it's a sr string writer and it's a pdf doc dot close and uh, response dot write and here we pass the pdf doc and then response dot end 
and then we will pass a grid view one dot allow paging equal to true if we paging then it's true or false it's a grid view dot data bind now we write one more functions for verifying server it's a public overwrite overwrite wide wide and it's a verifying verifying rendering in server form and then we remove it now we run this page so view this page in a browser now it's loading a page and it's display the data from the database page and then now we click on export to pdf data is exported then click to this exported pdf it's now opening my pdf now it's display the records from the grid view so that is for uh, export uh, how to export a grid view into pdf form so thanks for watching if you have any questions please write in a comment box and if you like my videos please click on subscribe buttons and uh, notifications bell and get my latest updates so thanks for watching we will meet in next video session